Hola a todos, bienvenidos. In this video, we're actually in Fort Myers, Florida on my dad's boat. Tomas ended up having two weeks off of work over the holidays, so we're gonna be here for, I think, nine days. And this might seem kind of random, but you know what? I decided to share it because, first of all, memories. I mean, this is <laughs> gonna be maybe a once in a lifetime. I've talked about going out of your comfort zone and doing things different than you normally would, and this is definitely something I've never done before, living on a boat for nine-ish days. <laughs> What's going on? She keeps trying to play the guitar and then crying. Especially with a toddler. I mean, I could totally see it being perfectly fine by myself or even me and Tomas. But having a little kid who likes to run around, get into everything, <laughs> and we're on the water, a little bit more complicated. Good morning. You waking up? Got our bags. Tomas very graciously cleaned the entire, pretty much the entire bedroom, bathroom, closet yesterday. We packed up our own stuff. This is all that we have left here. Besides what we were bringing, but I need to say goodbye to our next last current previous. Well, well see. Pop tarts for breakfast. This little girl. Usually she doesn't like to put her jacket on, like when we go for a walk and stuff. Even though she likes going for a walk, she fights and fights to get her jacket on. 4:20 a.m. She comes and chucks me her jacket and puts it on, then she throws at her boots at me. She's just so excited to go. <laughs> Wanna see grandpa, hey? Wanna go see grandpa? grandpa? Yeah? Okay. Grandma? You wanna see grandma? You wanna say bye? Bye! You got your boots? Good thing it's 21 degrees out. Leaving Pennsylvania. Peace. Yeah. Siempre. Siempre, siempre. Thank you very much. Yo solo ando mi bolsa. De la cámara. Y él. Huge line. Still waiting in line. It's a good thing we got here super early because. No sé cómo iba todo, pero sé que vos si tenés que viajar solo, yo sé que vas a estar bien con ella. Oh, security was so fast because I thought it was going to be so terrible because of there was that terrible line downstairs, but it's fine. Super fast. Yeah. Bye bye. Adiós. Uh, siete. You having fun? <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Flies together. Yeah, all three of us. Yeah. And she's what, 16? Boarding us complete. Yeah. Let attendants to the cabin for departure. We'll be hungry when I get to Florida. Yeah. Lunch when we get there. It is now 10:15. Should be leaving very shortly. No service during the flight. They gave us these when we got on the plane. So yeah. crackers and water and hand sanitizer. White. No go. No. <laughs> de invierno, Valentina con botas de invierno, yo con camisa larga, en Florida. We got a car, 11,000 miles, 
I don't know, Mitsubishi, I don't know what it is, but um, got everything packed up in the back. I think you know who we're going to see? Grandpa. Are we going to see Grandpa? Do you think maybe we should go sit in your car seat in the back? Okay. Parquímetro nuevo. Oh, but we can't put pennies in there. Here, you get some more quarters. Vamos a tratar. No. No, no, you can't put pennies in there. It's quarters only. <laughs> it says. when you're living on a boat, right? Yeah. <laughs> Grab the soap. And get this cute little tiny hang on. Does this one work, Bruce? Oh, there we go. It's just a little tiny bunk. Little cute little bench. Cute little cupboards. Gotta get used to the stepping across the little spot of water to get it on and off the boat. <laughs> and then you get to walk down this cool little dock to go to get your laundry. And you gotta have a lot of quarters. I actually have to come back and bring these to wash tomorrow because I don't have enough quarters, so. One load going. Why is it not going though? Is it broken? Oh, I was gonna say early morning. She's at it already, but she's already done driving. You gonna go back to the steering wheel? Good job. Are we there yet? Sure, Paul. Oh, look at that. Good morning. Good morning. Aquí en la guitarra. Listo para una para la de Romeo. I don't know how play. We got the whole rundown last night, but it was semi darkness, so I didn't want to film at the time, but one. Use water and electricity as much as you want when we're parked at the dock and plugged in. Yes, sir. But when we're out at sea, we have to be very sparing with the electricity and a little less sparing with the water. Well, we have a generator right now. Oh, yeah. The stove. These two are for the oven, and then you have to click this to ignite and use one hand clicking that and the other hand turning this to, until the flame starts. Valentina <laughs> Fernanda. We're trying to figure out if we go south towards Miami or north towards Tampa. Because either way, we gotta get back to the Fort Myers airport. North, we have a place, my dad has a place to park his boat for, for a, month. a month. But south, he hasn't found a place yet, so we'll see. But if we go south, we get to go to the Keys. Oh, we have showers here. Like, we can go use the, the marina showers here. But once we leave here, we don't know when they're we're gonna get our next shower. <laughs> well, there's a shower in the bathroom. We can't use it though. I know. <laughs> hmm, that is something like signing out. It's really hard for me. For you now. To go use the showers here, we gotta have this card. And it's worth $50. So if we lose it, we will be paying $50. <laughs> feels like a little bit complicated with a little kid who likes to run around because the dogs have no fences or railings or whatever so she could just go right off the edge if I'm not carrying her so I had to carry her and I have my towels obviously stuff in my pocket here shampoo and stuff and then getting on and off the boat with her yeah stepping up onto that it's just a little bit harder than doing it by myself, but I am really looking forward to this week.
The shower was decent, it, they had warm water, and it ran, so that was good. It wasn't anything powerful or anything, but glad we got a shower. And when you know that you don't know when your next shower is going to be, it makes you appreciate your shower that much more. <laughs> Thank you, honey. You're such a good helper. Gracias por ver. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you learned something. I hope this inspires you to go do something different. And maybe it's not going to be as crazy as going to live on a boat for nine days, but there's always something you can do. And here we go. Look. Chasing her all here. Be careful by the water, okay? Yeah. That's different than what from then that's different from what you're used to doing. And like I said, if you're struggling with actually speaking Spanish with other people in order to practice and get better at speaking fluently and comprehend and listening comprehension, even though this like living on a boat that I've never done before has nothing to do with actually speaking Spanish or growing my confidence, it actually helps if you just keep doing little things as you do. More and more little things, it'll get easier to do slightly bigger things and on and on. So keep that in mind. Hey, it's me editing and I forgot to say, I will be sharing the rest of our trip from this boat trip in future videos. They will just be kind of bonus videos in the middle of the week. So stay tuned. <laughs>